Hey everybody, this uh, video is for Matt Legrand. Uh, this is Dave Bussy, uh, TMODZ on Zwift, uh, which is where the pain cave comes in, and uh, dial cycling for my uh, real life team. So um, somebody wanted to see pain caves, so I'm going to show you my pain cave. Um, my house is behind me. Um, flip the camera around, and uh, you got to go through the French doors. It's an, a little ADU wood sided. It's about 12 by 12. Um, as you come in, you see lots of uh, bikes, a helmet. Don't know what you need that for in a pain cave. Um, got a heater for winter, although I don't use it really. Uh, it does keep it from freezing in here though. Um, mountain bike wheels. So we got the cross bike, mountain bike, funky old mountain bike. Uh, steel is real. Uh, you have the green screen, which I actually need to reconfigure, but uh, it works well as it is. Um, Back wall, we got uh, got the TMODZ magnetic uh, deal from uh, uh, camp a couple years ago. Uh, team logo on the side of your car looks pretty pretty good. Um, be nice to have that uh, for dialed, maybe. They're pretty cheap, too. Um, got your tools, everything you need to fix a bike. Old uh, tires, old rims, old wheels. I uh, got our, the leftovers of the record collection out here, so that's always good. Um, it's got more tools and food and all kinds of junk. Um, got the spare trainer. Um, got the, uh, the the bike stand. Uh, got the road wheel for the road bike that's on the trainer. Um, over in this other corner, before we get to the actual setup, um, we got some fishing gear, some golf stuff, some levels. Um, now, here's a couple things you have to have for your uh, pain cave. Uh, for those cold winter mornings in an unheated room, um, I have the uh, heater, which I actually plug into a uh, switched uh, uh, Wi-Fi outlet that will um, I can program from my phone to come on and off automatically at different times. Pretty nice. Um, we are now past that time, though, so now we're into the air conditioner time. This thing will do a room about three to four times the size, so it'll keep it at 62 degrees in here, no problem. Um, so here's here's the main bike. Um, you notice there's coffee on it. Just did a ride actually a few minutes ago. Um, it's the uh, light speed. Um, slightly heavier, their line weighs about 18 pounds, but hey, on Zwift, doesn't matter. Um, got the uh, R1 uh, Kinetic Trainer. Uh, which has had terrible reviews. Uh, once they got the um, once they got the physics of the power dialed in, it's actually not too bad. But I actually use a um, stages for my power anyway. Um, if I come over this way, um, obviously I'm not riding at the moment, but uh, I do have this interesting uh, U-shaped desk that I created a couple years ago. So I got the laptop for control on the right. Uh, I've got the 42-inch um, monitor in the middle. Um, you're watching a recreation uh, on Mixer that I did. Um, got the Yeti mic on the side. Uh, nothing but the best. Uh, never have enough towels. It's the end of the week, so I'm down to two clean towels. A uh, bunch of old t-shirts and junk. Uh, extra water bottles. Um, two key things, uh, the remote for the AC and the remote for the, uh, for the fan and the fan is a three speed. So you can always, uh, go easy when you're first warming up and such, and then, uh, ramp it up. Um, one other thing you have to have is, uh, music. So that's running, uh, running off Spotify, uh, through the, uh, TV speakers, which actually sound not too bad in here. Um, you got your, your Fortnite Yama, so those are nice to have. A uh, little thing from Hawaii, a little thing from Star Wars, a um, couple of uh, Datsun Roadster race cars. Um, this is actually the internals of my original um, R1, and uh, it went bad, so they sent me a new one, and uh, they told me to replace it myself, so I did. Um, Key Portland Beard, of course. Um have the wireless remote that will um, work the computer if I choose, although I do everything pretty much on the uh, iPhone uh, companion app. Um, 
So I use screen capture um, with a couple of things on the computer uh, to get onto Mixer. So I have, uh, this is my setup, it's OBS, um, which does all the video parts of it. You can do different screens and different things. Um, and then the audio portion goes through a uh, program called Banana. Um, so you can take your different inputs, different levels, outputs, um, send outputs to different places, stuff like that. So that's, that's pretty cool. Um, I do have a view um, out in my backyard. I have a window that opens, which is good sometimes and bad sometimes. Um, and the exhaust, of course, for the air conditioning. Um, and uh, this video that we're watching right now is me in a um, team time trial um, that I did actually get dropped from my group. But that's part of what you do in a team time trial. Um, also notice I've got the... Uh, Dialed cycling on my overlay, got the uh, Team ODZ on my overlay, uh, different sponsors, got the Hub, um, Beetroot Pro, Cracking Club, Norco, uh, my mountain bike brand. I need to get a light speed on there. Don't have that one. Um, anyways, so that is pretty much uh, what my bike place looks like. Um, do lots of riding in here, probably about 5,000 miles a year, unfortunately. Um, it's just easier, just better sometimes. So anyways, I uh, hope this is what you're looking for. Uh, feel free to edit, download, cut, um, use parts of it, use none of it, laugh at it, whatever you want to do. So this is uh, Dave Bussey signing out.